Welcome to Kravit University. Our history is a story of innovation, global brand expansion, and the indispensable role that people play in making a company successful. It all began in 1903 when the founder of our company, my great-grandfather, Samuel Kravit, immigrated to the United States from Russia to Canada, eventually settling in New York. The story we have been told is that he arrived with few belongings but the clothing he wore and the sewing machine that he used to earn a living. Perfecting his trade learned in Russia, he began tailoring clothing of upscale clientele in the Lower East Side of Manhattan. Being an entrepreneur, Samuel realized that his customers buying buttons, elastics, and zippers for apparel might also have a need for decorative tiebacks and trimmings for the home. He offered these additional items when he serviced clients. He eventually opened a trimming store in 1918. In 1921, his son Saul joined him as seen here. There was a transformation in 1923 when all four of his sons joined the company. The business name became S. Kravit and Sons. In 1924, they began selling fabric for home furnishings. In the mid-30s, S. Kravit and Sons began selling fabric and trim exclusively to the interior design trade. This important shift, selling to the interior design trade, changed our business dramatically. We were no longer a business-to-consumer operation. We became a business-to-business -business operation. As the profession of interior designer began to emerge in New York City, S. Kravit and Sons was there to serve them. My father, Larry Kravit, entered the business in 1948. In 1960, our name was officially changed to Kravit Fabrics, as we were now more focused on the sale of fabrics. Expansion led to a greater need for space, so in 1963, my father moved our family business to Long Island, the next step of our evolution. Kravit Fabrics opened a corporate office and warehouse in Woodbury, Long Island. Throughout the mid-60s, under my father's leadership, we started establishing corporate showrooms nationwide. Chicago, Los Angeles, San Francisco, Miami, Dallas, Denver, Atlanta, and the growth continued throughout the United States. Our showrooms foster the relationships between our customers and their clients. Not only do they fashionably showcase our products, they are a meeting place where we can assist the interior design trade and help them satisfy the needs of their clients. By 1980, we outgrew the space in Woodbury and in the same year, our corporate office and warehouse was built in Bethpage, New York. During the construction process, it was definitely a family affair. Seen here are my father, Larry Kravitz, along with my brothers, Carrie and Scott, overseeing the new development. My father is shown cutting the ribbon to officially open the building, along with my grandmother, Mrs. Sadie Kravitz. Continued success leads to further expansion. Once again, in 1989, we outgrew our space and built a building with more room for potential growth. Anderson, South Carolina would be the new home to a second warehouse and storage facility for our increasing product offerings. Currently, two-thirds of our distribution comes out of our South Carolina warehouse. In an effort to facilitate international progress, Kravit expands the business to Canada. In 1989, Kravit Fabrics Canada was established. 1991 marked another pivotal year for Kravit. It was a natural progression to expand into the furniture market, so that year we started selling Kravit furniture and have quickly emerged as a leader in that home furnishings arena. Kravit fabric can be used on all our upholstered furniture pieces and we merchandise our showrooms to showcase both. Kravit was innovative in its thinking and proactive in meeting the demand. Kravit acquired Lee Jofa in 1995 one of the oldest fabric companies in the world dating back to 1823. Lee Jofa is known for luxury and very exclusive English tradition. Lee Jofa became part of the Kravit family of brands, adding a high-end option to the existing line of Kravit offerings. 
Kravit now had selections at many different price levels, thereby expanding our customer base. In 2001, Kravit acquired GP&J Baker, a company known for its rich history, hand screen printing techniques, and vast collection of archival documents. The famed GP&J Baker archive, a collection of weaves and prints, comprises the most extensive privately held archive in the world. In addition, Baker proudly holds the Royal Warrant, a mark recognizing high standards of service and excellence to the Royal family. GP&J Baker is a complementary brand within the existing product base. The line is appropriate for both the United States and overseas markets and is distributed from our facility in Poole, England. This acquisition added an interesting dynamic to the existing brands within Kravit. In 2002, we became Kravit Inc., a new name reflective of our brand's expansion into various product categories. We were no longer just a fabric resource. In 2005, we launched Kravit Carpet, which has quickly proven to be a successful endeavor. Our product lines offer the interior designer more choices when working on client projects. Most recently, in 2011, Kravit acquired Brunswick Effis, a brand rich in history, tradition, and quality. We are thrilled to have Brunswick as part of our family of brands. We will continue to develop its rich French history into design that is reminiscent of the past as well as relevant to today's high-end design market. We have already expanded the brand's representation to service our overseas markets with new showrooms in Paris and London. This acquisition puts Kravit in a category of its own in terms of the representation of brands and sheer volume of product available for the design industry. There truly is something for everyone. Our timeline brings us to today where Kravit has grown to be the industry leader in home furnishings, including fabrics, furniture, wall coverings, trimmings, carpet and accessories. With locations in North America and worldwide, Kravit offers the highest level of quality products and customer service. The Kravit family's commitment to innovation has helped the company transform from a small family-run fabric house in 1918 to today's global leader in home furnishings representing brands and licensed collections from all over the world. Kravitz product offerings range in style from traditional to contemporary, and our commitment to customer service extends to the web, where customers can access our products 24 hours a day. We are proud to have discovered new ways of satisfying our customers' design needs and do everything we can to help them work more efficiently and profitably. We are a fourth generation family-owned company that prides itself on our service, commitment to quality, and vast product selection. Now, as we enter our second century in business, we have evolved into a company doing business in over 100 countries. We have been fortunate throughout the years to have loyal and talented employees that truly care about our company. Their devotion and hard work has enabled us to become a global leader in the industry. Our family values still nurture our growth. We are a family who live our lives with honesty, integrity, and reliability, and have surrounded ourselves with employees who do the same. This was the foundation for success in our early years, and it will continue to be the foundation wherever the journey takes us next. <music>